Hello and welcome to another video from Videx. In today's video we're going to have a look at setting up the WS4 Web Server Access Control System. The first connection and configuration of the system we need to connect the WS4 to a PC. There's two methods to do this. Method 1 for use in a home or business local area network. In this configuration the network's DHCP server will assign an IP address to your WS4 controller. First, put DIP switch 1 in the OFF position. Connect a cable from your network to the Ethernet connector of the WS4 controller. Open up a web browser and enter http forward slash forward slash WS4 followed by a dash and the serial number of the WS4 controller. If you cannot connect, it's because your network does not recognize the name of the WS4 controller. In this case, go to the website www.xprgroup.com forward slash products forward slash WS4 and download the tool called Device Finder. The Device Finder will enable you to find out the IP address of the WS4 controller. Run the Device Finder and you'll get a list of all WS4 controllers connected to your network including their IP addresses, just like the picture. In this case, open up a browser and type in the IP address of the WS4 controller and you'll be prompted to the login page. The username is admin and the password will be WS4 followed by a dash and then the serial number of the controller. Method 2. For standalone use without a local area network. In this configuration, the WS4 controller will assign an IP address to your PC. The PC must be set to obtain IP addresses automatically. First, put DIP switch 1 in the ON position. Connect the cable from your PC directly to the Ethernet of the WS4 controller. Open up a web browser and enter the following IP address 192.168.50.100. And then put in your login credentials just like before. Thanks for watching. Please click on like and subscribe. And have a look at our other videos in the WS4 series.